in the Volvo and we're back again with him. Out of the chicane, Reed ahead of us, Anthony Reed in the Nissan Primera. He hasn't had the best of meetings so far. He had a big... Oh, a big, big one! It's Tarquini! Tarquini, what a meeting! Off into the mud in race one, off in race two earlier, and now this. He's hit the Amco very, very hard on the outside of the circuit, straight after the chicane, Murray. He's OK, he's jumped out of the car. Oh, that's good to see. He's all right. He's over the fence and behind the protective barrier, but he's gone in really hard. They're going to have to stop the race, yeah, Charlie. Right. It's a replay. Yeah, through the chicane. Oh, look, he's just clipped the tyres on the inside. That's upset the car completely, thrown it to one side. It automatically will want to follow the line of the wheels. And you can see it's gone to the outside of the circuit, clouded the Amco really hard and then spun around again. Yeah, stuck on the track. There's no way they're going to let the race go on with... Uh, the Honda sitting on the tarmac there. Very dangerous when you come out of that corner. Yeah, safety cars out. Well, this is going to close things up a lot. Menu's got Thompson right behind him now. And Leslie, well, there's Gabrielli. Thank heavens he looks perfectly OK. I spun alone. Alone? Yeah. Oh dear. A mechanical problem, perhaps? No, no, no. It was a mistake. I put my wheel on the, on the grass and I spun. Very bad luck. Well, he's a lovely man, Gabriele Tarquini, and that was a typically honest response. No, it was my fault. I put my wheel on the grass.